Guys, my name is Tom, and in this week's episode, we have decided that we are going to buy ourselves an all-sky camera. Look at this thing. It's the bomb. <laughs> yeah, it actually looks like a bomb, doesn't it? You know, something from, like, Die Hard. Welcome to the party! We've got to throw it out of a glass roof or something before it kills everybody in the building. It became mother... Just destroyed a building. A crazy looking device, isn't it? Look at that thing. I mean, is that insane or what? Don't forget, if you like the content, if you like the channel, please uh, consider subscribing, liking it, and, uh, and throw me a comment. I love everything to do with outside, the night, the sky, the clouds, the storms, the crazy weather that we have. But what are we going to capture with this? Shooting stars, comets, or if we could literally capture a picture of a UFO with this thing. Are UFOs real? Throw it down in the comment. Have you had any experiences with UFOs? Are there aliens? I mean, the odds are stacked against us saying no. There are aliens. Uh, I think we'd be silly to think that we was the only life form in the whole universe. So we're going to try and capture some really cool stuff with this. I didn't build it or anything like that, so I'm not going to take no credit. I bought it off of eBay. A guy had made two of them, and he had this. He had, doesn't have a back garden anymore. So, and it comes with a little remote control to turn on my heater and to turn on my fan. We're going to stick this on the side of the observatory somewhere. Uh, it's got a little 120mm uh, one-shot color camera in it as well guys i don't know what we're going to capture with this thing i'm super excited about it though it's going to be epic um but we're we're going to start putting it on the side of the shed really cool love it let's get to it right so i've got a bit of off cut and i'm thinking what i'm going to do if i cut that down there or do i want to go this way this way will look probably nicer let's cut it there and another section i'm not going to connect it to the top all right let's do that and guys this is why i actually got this camera let's have a little look around and you can see these clouds So there you go, we've got some crazy looking clouds out here. And uh, this is why I've kind of got this, because we're going to be able to see all of this going over on a time lapse. Yeah, see anything that's odd out there? we better get soaring then. Put a couple of screws into my little block here. I've just poked them out the end slightly just so that I can mark up where we're actually going to put them on the observatory. And there we go, that should stop that splitting when we put these through. Perfect, that's nice and solid. Alright, so I've just done my second block now, which is going to go on the first one that I've just put on, and that's just going to allow clearance. Right, just for safe measure, I think I'm going to pile it through a couple more holes and just put a couple of extra screws in. Right, so I found myself a little bracket as well that I'm going to screw onto it just to make sure that's definitely secured. guys so here it goes the moment of truth all 
All right, I'm pretty happy with that. I think now what I'm going to do, I'm going to drill a hole through the shed, put the wiring through. I've got a little bit of putty. I use the putty to fill the hole. This putty that I've got it actually works really well. The hole's been done. It's now time to get the wiring through. So I got this epoxy putty stuff, uh, which is what I've been using instead of silicon. I find this stuff's actually really good. It's like plasticine. That's probably why I like it so much. And then you just play with it. <laughs> Mate, this thing is gonna be so much fun. Oh, it stinks. And it kind of goes to like a blue tack. And then we make a nice little ball. And then I'll just plug the hole with it. Just like that. And there we go. It kind of goes all around the wires and, uh, and gives it a nice seal, so it's not the prettiest looking thing. And there we go. Here's our sky camera. All ready to rock and roll.